Hey guys, today we're going over how to practice locking your ankle in soccer. Now, I've already made a video on how to, <laughs> how to lock your ankle um, in soccer, but today we're going to be going over a few methods to practice this. Very easy things to do, so if you are having trouble in this area, just do these things consistently and you'll find that you're able to lock your ankle more effectively, which in turn is going to help your shooting ability. All right, guys, so I'm just going to show you a way you can tell if you're able to lock your ankle effectively. And it's a good way to practice as well. You'll need a buddy like this guy right here. All you're going to do is have your friend push on your toes and apply pressure, trying to push your ankle upwards as you have it locked. If he's able to do it easily, that means you're not able to lock your ankle that effectively. So if it just comes up like that, that's not good. You want to press down and keep it in place. And this is essentially what you want your foot to be like when you're shooting the ball, when you can make contact and during your follow through. All right guys, once you can effectively lock your ankle, you wanna start practicing shooting with a locked ankle. So one great way to do that is use a wall like I have here. And your goal at first is not to hit the crap out of the ball. It's to practice proper technique, keeping your ankle locked during contact and the follow through. So don't swing hard, just practice nice and easy, hitting it against the wall, having it come back and doing that until you get used to the technique. Once you have, the technique more down, you can start doing it further away and shooting harder. But as you're learning the technique, you need repetition after repetition after repetition of the proper technique. If you're shooting it as hard as you can and it's not, and you're not using the proper technique, you're going to learn this improperly. So you don't want to do that. Just nice and easy against the wall. Practice with your ankle locked. Keep the ball low. Focus on your technique. Once you get better, you can start moving a little further away and really start to apply more power on the ball after you've gotten much better at this technique. So I'll do one more. That's a good one. Whoa. All right, guys. So that's what you can do to practice this. If you don't have a wall, any surface is fine. At first, it's not how hard you hit it. It's practicing the proper technique over and over and over again.